Well, a very good evening to you. Lovely to have you along as we build up to this much-anticipated game. We want to get it started as soon as possibly we can because, as you can see for yourself, there have been weather issues today. The officials making absolutely sure that it is safe and OK to go ahead. Nothing has been left to chance in terms of preparations. Preparations have been meticulous, understandably so, when you take into account these most testing of conditions. What a sight, what a sound when Anfield is rocking. The crowd waits with huge excitement. A mouth-watering game this between two very high-quality sides. A treat for everybody here. Yes, Peter, it's a shame it's only a, a friendly, but then again, that may help us see a more expressive attacking contest. And I'd be prepared to settle for a, a clash of, of lesser intensity in favour of, of lots of flair skill and plenty of tricks and a few goals i suspect i've probably overstretched my my level of greed here rounds two high profile high caliber teams this is a welcome event for all these supporters well get ready for some high grade football peter two strong teams as you say full of wonderful individual talent and we have every right to anticipate some really entertaining football. As to whether we'll see a high-scoring contest, that's a little harder to predict. I'm not complaining, though, because they're good players. And the shots! It's in! Some of the best managers I've played for insisted on starting games as you mean to go on. And we've just seen a very important opening goal from an extremely talented individual who looks primed for more. He really does look at it. Quite exquisite, brilliantly dispatched. Suarez simply judged everything beautifully. That takes a lot of training ground practice, and we know what practice can make. Well, that has certainly made things interesting. Di Maria. And it's Rabio. Get it forward quickly. Now it's Cavani. Titi gets it back. He's looked long this time. Mbappe gets on the end of it. It's Rabio! Good stop. That wasn't easy. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. And the weighted pass. And he's there to cut it out. Philippe Coutinho. Now it's Philippe Coutinho. Coutinho spreads it towards the left. Oh, it's opened up nicely for him. He's gone for it. Really well taken goal. Hot knife through butter. They have done it again. A deflection may or may not have made a difference. Little matter, it is his. starting to look very comfortable the turning of the screw comes to mind Peter they've got them where they want them and no that is pretty much the end of that needless to say he was expecting a better ball than that so Luther looked promising but uh, eventually thwarted without doing any harm Luis Suarez, Messi, can he finish? Oh, he's done ever so well. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeper. Oh, smart save. Managed to get it away. Rakitic, played into the middle. And that's been leave it clear. Roberto, now it's Rakitic. On the right now, what's on? Oh, 
he's got good distance. Who's chasing? Rakitic plotting from out on the right-hand side. Roberto has come steaming up from the back for this. Shakes the shoot! Well, to put it this way, he's probably made better decisions. Thiago Silva. Now it's Philippe Coutinho. Rules loose, who's getting there? And the whistle goes for half-time. Any opinion you'd like to express on the first half? Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position. Barcelona ahead 2-0, and they are looking good. We're probably into the second 45 minutes. Draxler tried to play it through. Draxler encouraged the pass with an intelligent run, but the pass just lacked pace. That intervention was very necessary. Roberto. Cavani. Cavani! A great save. How wrong he was. Neymar goes short. And a shot! And in again. And the ball's come out. Neymar. Kozawa. It's a brilliant interception. Messi takes the long option. Di Maria. A couple of goals between the sides, and it's still early in the second half. Neymar looking to get on the end of this. Can he get the shot away? Can he put it away? Well, the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. And the counter is on. Rakitic goes up and over. Goes for goal! Really outwitted one-on-one. -on -one. Once more, he gets the better of the keeper. Yeah, he always had the measure of the keeper, and there was very little doubt as to how this was going to end up. some movement on the bench and we are going to see a change I just think that's really good management introducing one of his younger players when the pressure's totally off just allowing him some valuable easy on-field experience time Barcelona take a three-goal lead and they are romping out of sight and that's a throw And it's been taken straight back. And it's Luis Suarez. More than happy to take the muscular approach. Peter, we can only applaud that quality of tackle in the circumstances. It was probably goal saving. He had to be at his best. Barcelona were again presented with an opportunity to break and look very, very threatening. <laughs> Paris Saint-Germain have turned to their bench and we're going to have a substitution. Well, you have to feel a little for the player being taken off here. I think he's been made the scapegoat after that, but I guess something had to be done. I suppose it did need a little change. Cavani is on his own and he's looking to shoot. Mistake! They're back within reach! Cavani showed real composure then. I mean, how often do you see a player do everything right until he gets into the box, only to completely kind of fluff the finish? Not him. So is this the start of a comeback? Jordi 
Silva. Ain't long and direct. Rafinha. Into the last five minutes. And, uh, lack of accuracy. Rafinha needed to come up with a better ball. Uh, was too timid to make it through the defence. It'll be noted and, and improved upon, I'm sure. Rafinha. And it's Messi. Now it's Luis Suarez. The final whistle. So they have their win. They had all the answers to whatever the opposition threw at them. And the results followed inevitably. And after all of that, Jim, what are you thinking? I think it's all about setting the right tone at the start of a match. And if you can back that up with an early goal, it just energises everybody, the whole performance. And I think they were certainly more fluid as a result of the early...